So if you're wondering how to exactly fix your 8-bit do ultimate software, if it's not it's not recognizing the controller, well there are a few things that you may want to do here. So first is first is you may want to connect the controller with a USB-C cable. Now the 8-bit 2 Ultimate 2C can only be detected in the Ultimate software when it's physically connected using a USB-C cable. Now Bluetooth mode won't work for detection, so plug it directly into your Mac or PC using a data capable USB-C cable. Then reopen the software and from then on see if that actually works. And also, you want to make sure the cable supports data, not just charging. Now, a common issue is using a cable that only charges but does not transfer data. Now, if the controller charges but the software doesn't detect it, well, you may want to switch to another USB-C cable, ideally one included in the box. So, go ahead and see if it actually works. Now, again, make sure that it supports uh, data transfer. Next is you may want to restart the 8B2 uh, ultimate software here. Now close the app completely, including from the system tray or dock, then plug in the controller first. And after that, reopen the software so it can detect the device during launch. Now also, you may want to put the controller into firmware update mode, so if the software still doesn't recognize it, try manually putting the controller into update mode. So you want to hold the pair button, then plug the USB-C cable while still holding the button. This forces the controller into detection mode, so the software can interact with it. And also, try reinstalling the Ultimate software, so older versions of the app sometimes fail to detect your controllers. So uninstall the software completely, download the latest version from the 8Bit2's site, and reinstall it. Now this resets the driver files and handle, and handle controller communication. Now also try a different USB port here. Now the issue may be with the port rather than the controller, so switch to a USB 3.0 port on your computer, or try a different side of the laptop. Now this helps in case where a uh, port is three, uh, isn't supplying enough power. Now also you may want to hold the pair button here for about like eight to ten seconds to reset the controller's internal co connection profile. Now reconnect it afterward and reopen the software. This often solves stubborn connection problems. And if the controller is, uh, still doesn't show up at all here, the USB port on the controller or the internal board uh, uh, beep faulty. So reaching out to 8B2 support or asking technician to inspect it is the best next step here that you could do. But that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.